your interest in music and what involvement did you have in it before your DJ and producing career? Um, I've, I've always like loved music. When I was younger, you know, I would every second I was alone, I would always put on my headphones and, and listen to music. But I never really thought that I could do, I, you know, I could do it as a profession. Um, well, when I first started playing before Eric, I wanted to, you know, keep it pretty, pretty chilled, not to be too full on. Um, but then he told me he was like, "Do your own thing, you know, uh, you do whatever you want." Uh, so eventually, I started to to do my own thing. It's always important to respect who you're playing before. Uh, it's always appreciated, you know, when when someone takes that into consideration. You're the first artist that Eric Prez has kind of taken under his wing and his protege. How did you first sync up with Eric and how has it affected your career? Uh, well, basically, I was, uh, I've always been a huge fan of his music ever since I got into uh, to house music. So I kept sending him stuff and eventually his, his management picked up and uh, gave me this deal that I would tour with him and release music through his label. And, you know, it's been a huge deal for me because before then, I, you know, I was doing all right. I was releasing music, but but that's when it really uh, took off. You know, I was I was touring a lot. Um, it's definitely made a big impact on my career. I didn't get into house music until I was like 16, 17, so before that uh, I listened to a lot of Michael Jackson, like a lot. I was a huge fan of him. Um, my dad showed me a lot of like 60s, 70s music, Ben Morrison, uh, Creedence, Courier, World Revival, uh, stuff like that. Uh, then I got into hip hop, and like 90s uh, New York hip hop, East Coast. Um, so I think it's just a big blend of pretty much everything. Trying to learn learn cooking a lot better. I think that's a lot of fun, you know, just sipping a little bit of red wine and <laughs> cooking up in the kitchen. Um, or just hanging out with friends or family. I have a lot of new music I want to put out. Um, hopefully I can get my own label started soon, which I'm really, I'm really keen on doing that. Um, just keep on touring and uh, playing.